Panic on the streets of London Panic on the streets of Birmingham I wonder to myself Could life ever be better On the leads side streets of the ship now I wonder Hopes they rise in the country The honey pie and the safety You run down The safety of the town Put this panic on the streets of Carlisle Trafalgar Square and it's just gone 11. Where is the resistance? This is what I want to know. Huh? <laughs> How you doing, fellas? Come on, squeeze, get it together. <laughs> Here, here's Vin. Here's RWP. Here's Keelan. Here's Cookie. Here's Johnny. There's the police. Here's Squiddles. Ladies and gentlemen, please remember that the surveillance police helicopters and armed police are for your protection. Soldiers, don't give yourselves to brutes. Men who despise you, enslave you, who regiment your lives, tell you what to do, what to think and what to feel, who drill you, diet you, treat you like cattle, use you as cannon fodder. Don't give yourselves to these unnatural men, machine men, with machine minds and machine hearts. You are not machines, you are not cattle, you are men. If you leave your house past 9 p.m., you will be blown up by terrorists. Please remember that, ladies and gentlemen. Everything is okay! Ladies and gentlemen, five minutes of fame awaits you. Come on, come on, look at the television crew. So there's going to be a revolution today. Please do not listen to the domestic extremist. He has a very naughty boy. Everyone please look at the police photographer up there. Right there, everyone. Give him a nice wave, give him a smile. This is good for a police database. This is what three humans look like. <laughs> and kick. Hey, wait there, wait there.
to cook. <laughs> Come on, I know Jack Bauer from 24 would use technology to rescue it. Come on, there's terrorist information in there. Oh, look at that. How dare you be protesting? How dare you? Later on, when I'm having champagne with George and David, I'll tell them about the peasant rabble in Trafalgar Square. And I'll tell him how the clowns in dress and jackets sorted them out. absolute chaos on the streets of London. Panic on the streets of London. It's just so hard to keep up with crowds and spearheads of uh, protests. That, uh, I mean, this is just going to have to become a personal journey. As you can see, it just goes on and on and on, the protest. I've lost the resistance radio crew, sorry guys. But I'm just going to follow the protest, see where it takes me. So here we are in Hyde Park and everyone's just queuing up for food. Queuing up for hot dogs. Must have a hot dog. The revolution must be waged on a variety of meats. 
Yeah. We're all still pouring in, as you can see behind me there. The usual sort of thing, really. Placards, flags, banners, the old chant here and there. You know, a lot of people sat down making sandwiches, and I know you've got to eat and all that, but, you know, it seems like we've been led here on purpose into a park. So now there are just lots of people leaving the park. Job done. People with banners all leaving the park. We abandoned the banner. It's all still going on. They're all going to Hyde Park, but we're going in the other way, going back to Trafalgar Square. It's basically people just stood around with placards and, uh, you know, it's just, just nothing going on really. I want to see some action. Nelson's Column in London on Sunday morning. Sunday did occur as normal. There was no revolution, folks. What do you think about that? I fought the low one, I fought 